Hello everyone and welcome to Zublo's Kitchen. Today I am once again joined by Nina. Hi. And today we are going to be making no bake peanut butter bars. Ooh, Simple good. and easy and fuss free. <laughs> <laughs> what do we do first? So we have peanut butter, powdered sugar, butter, vanilla, coconut oil, which is optional, and then our chocolate. So pretty much what we're going to do, we lined a... Sort of lined. <laughs> we lined a uh, pan with parchment paper. And as you said, it was 11 by what? 8 by 11? 8 by 11. It requires 9 by 13, but that's okay. So what we're going to do is we are going to take our stick of butter... Put it in the bowl. Just like that. Okay. And then we need two cups. Oh, I forgot the thing. Two cups of creamy or chunky, whatever you'd like, peanut butter. I think this would work. Scoop it out. Sure. I'll, I'll let you do that. Okay, thanks. Um, and then we need three and a half cups of powdered sugar, and then a teaspoon and a half of vanilla. However, we're just going to measure that with our eyeballs, because it's okay if it's a little more vanilla. -y. And what we're going to do is we are going to blend everything together besides the chocolate. The chocolate we're going to melt once we put... Uh, our mixture into our pan. Do we need more? I figured we could just use the whole thing. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna scoop this in here. Yeah, they can see that. And I'm gonna get all out. All out. Oops. Okay. That's one cup. You know, I'm just gonna stick the rest of this in here because it's another cup. That works. Another cup. I need uh, a spurtle. A what? A spurtle. Something I saw somewhere. Do you have one? No. I do not. Alright. So, I will... You keep going while I dig out this peanut butter. Okay. We're using powdered sugar in these first because that's what she had. So I'm going to do, it's three cups. This might be a cup in itself. Maybe not. Almost. Almost, yeah. All right, well, that one's gone. So I'll reach over here. The jar of peanut butter is empty. All right, that's so, one cup. Okay. Um, I'm gonna throw this. In. I need to wash my hands real quick. Oops. Almost, almost another. bit more. I'm going to do this over here. Ooh. That's two. Looks like you need more powdered sugar. Okay. When I get to the store, I'll get some more. That's three. I thought you said three. No, that's three. I thought you said it was, oh, three and a half. Oh, sorry. Yeah, three and a half. Good. And a half. And then vanilla. I'm just gonna eyeball it. Ooh. More? Yeah, yeah throw another shot. Alright. Alright. Now we're gonna blend this up. And remember, clean up as you go. Did it? Yeah, 
keep it on low until it gets a little mixed and bring up the speed. It's supposed to be crumbly. Yes. Hi. Cool. Get it all mixed together. Well, not it's quite. looking good. No, I said get it all mixed oh. together. What do you think of that? Hmm? Good. All right. I'm gonna put these over there. Where is? What do you need now? I took out a. Oh, here it is. <coughs> oh, bless you. Thank you. I have a tablespoon. Do you mix that in here? No. This goes with the chocolate. Oh. So we're going to take a tablespoon of coconut oil and we're going to put it in with our chocolate. This is going to be nice and silky. I see you grabbed out the heath. Yeah. I think we could sprinkle it on top a little. Oh, okay. You know? You don't want it melted? No. Okay. No. All right. Well, if you want to do the honors and put that in the pan. Sure. Let me just, uh... I will, uh... All right. Let's see. As she does this, I'm going to melt this in the microwave at 30 second intervals. Until it's nice and melted? Yes. Nice and melted. <coughs> and silky and delicious. In the pan. Smells good, looks good. It sure does. And easy because it's no bake. You don't have to bake this. Right? Can't easy. Wait to taste. And who doesn't love peanut butter? Besides the people that can't have peanut butter. And I'm sure those people love peanut butter, but they can't have it. What it looks like. Give this a nice stir. I'm trying to do this. I'm just pressing it on the bottom of the pan. If you can't have peanut butter, you can make. Um, I feel like you can make like a graham cracker crust and then do like a, a cheesecake and put chocolate on top Ooh, too. Yeah. I'm a cheesecake lover. Uh, what else would you be able to do if you would if, if you can't eat peanut butter? I'm trying to think what else. I don't know. Main thing I thought was of cheesecake. That's yeah. it. Pudding? Oh yeah, you could do pudding. I could, yeah. Okay. Almost done here. As you can see, it's melting. I'm just trying to even this out. I'm just pushing it down with my hands. Looks good. It smells good. And I love me my peanut butter. And like I said, you could use crunchy. If you like crunchy, right. you could use... Um, use any kind of food. Yeah. Crunchy, smooth, chunky. If you want no sugar, you could probably use no, no sugar. sugar. This should be good.
put it in there for another, this is what it looks like. I have to do for another, well, maybe not. Ooh, that looks good. No, we're good. So about a minute and a half is uh, the melting chocolate time. Okay, so I have mushed this. As best you can. Filling in the bottom of the pan here, as you can see. All right. Okay, I'm gonna slide this over to you. Okay. Then we're just gonna. Well, yeah, I was gonna say, can we, can we switch? We're just gonna dump this on here, and we're just gonna spread it out. Someone's walking with a lawnmower, I think. I'm just gonna go ahead and like that. Ooh. A nice thin layer of chocolate. Oh, that looks good. Even though some people don't like chocolate. Well, it, it depends. Like, I, I don't, I'm not a fan of chocolate cake. I hate chocolate ice cream. I'm not one of those people that craves chocolate or has to have chocolate all, every day. I do wow. have a little more, but oh, scoop it on there. Scoop it on there, she scoop says. Scoop it on there. Wanted to add the topping? Sure. Let's try some. Um, you got a? You need a scissor? Oh, I have it right here. But my hands are full of peanut butter right now. No, here. I would throw some of those. I don't have to use them all, but you know. I just thought for a little crunch, so you didn't cut it open. I did not. You know, for a little crunch. Oops. Toffee and peanut butter. Mmm. Alright, just, just we're just gonna sprinkle, it. sprinkle it. it a little. You oh tell me God. when. Okay, I think we're good. Alright. And that's what it looks like. Now we gotta let this sit at room temperature for about an hour. And then we'll be able to try it. So we'll be back. Mmm. We'll be back to taste. Here are the dishes. So we gotta let that cool, like the chocolate cool for an hour. And then we're gonna cut them up and then we're gonna put them in the fridge for an hour. So it's gonna be about two hours until we try them. Okay? Sounds good to me. I can't wait to dig in. So we'll be back. All right, so we are back with our little no-bake peanut butter bars. Uh, Nina had to run out for a moment, so she'll be back. But I want to get these into the fridge because that is where they need to be. They need to be um, put placed in the fridge um, for at least an hour or until we're ready to serve. So we're going to do that. However, I'm going to cut. It says to cut it up. Let's see how, how long this goes. Alright, so we're going to just take our knife and I'm just going to cut these up. Ooh, they slice very nicely. And I'm just going to cut them into squares, almost like brownie squares. Okay, and then I'm going to do the other way. Can you, yeah, you guys can see that. Now remember... We put, um, I think it was Heath topping on there. Um, I forgot what Nina use, uses these for. I think for her toffee squares, but it's like these, it's little uh, Heath bites, I believe they're called. Oh, as I drop them all over the floor, but that's okay, I'll pick them up. So we're just gonna, those are sprinkled on top. You don't have to have those, uh, but Nina wanted them. So I said, that's fine. So there we go. Those are, those are look really nice. Uh, we're gonna put this up to the side and I'm gonna get a plate. Let them rest in the pan for two hours? An hour. An hour. 
Then he cut them up into little squares and put them in the fridge for another hour. Roughly, yeah. They look really good. They remind me of um, your toffee squares. Like the toffee square, yes, with mm -hmm. peanut butter. Thank you. I will. Ready? Cheers. Cheers. Here you go. Mmm. Not bad. Mm. Very good for a no bake. Mm -hmm. well, for me though, I think he knows what I'm going to say. For me, get rid of the chocolate. The chocolate should be thinner, mm -hmm. but I'm not a chocolate person. That's why the peanut butter flavor is really good. It's not that sweet. Mm -mm. I'm not nervous that little crunch from the little piece bar pieces we put on top. Really good. And you it know what? Good. It's a fast dessert to make. It is. You know? If all of a sudden, ooh, I got a phone call. Company's coming. What do I do? Grab some peanut butter, grab some vanilla, grab some powder sugar, chocolate. Butter. Butter. There Usually all ingredients you have in your house. Maybe not the chocolate, but... True. No, that's good. I wonder if you could... Instead of the chocolate, well... Make like a... The frosting type thing to put over here. Oh, I'm sure you could. You know? I'm sure you could. But they're very good. It only takes a few minutes to put it together. It's the resting that takes a while. But you know what? So they're a little. What? I was going to say, if you couldn't let them rest for the two hours, they might be, it, peanut butter might be a little soft. I was going to say, throw it in the freezer. That throw or it in the freezer. instead of having it rest on the counter, just put it in the fridge. Mm -hmm. Put it in the... In the pan. In the pan in the fridge. Very good. A quick, quick and easy dessert snack. I'll do that again. Okay. Yep, I agree. Well, that does it for this episode of Zelto's Kitchen with Nina. Thank you all so much for watching. I really appreciate it. We really appreciate it. Hope you all have a wonderful day. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Remember to be the best you can be, and we'll see you all in the next video. Bye! Bye.